Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Mm. Cantilever ring, sixth this mid century. It's, oh, it's jazz legend Dave Brubeck's house. Ooh. And it was a case study house for architect Beverly Thorne. Wow, imagine the imagine the musical notes coming out of this house. Probably better than your house, Chris. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Definitely. Jazz musician? Yeah. Sure. Do 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 ah! That's what I heard coming out of your room last yeah. night. It's a scat guy? Yeah. Dude, no, it was the Mentos commercial, but it's like do 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 and then the old lady sings uh, the screaming yeah, part when you start. Yep. Yeah. yeah, this is fat. These case study houses are dope. I have the case study book. This is cool though. Steel construction. Just a God, we used to do such cool things like uh with materials in the sixties. Like, let's figure out if we could build a cool living space using cheap and cost-efficient materials. Mm. And now they're just like, we're going to have uh, drunk Italian uh, contractors buy Ferraris and then try to m mitigate business amongst new construction and development. We're going to have Grant Cardone wire-eyed gym rats Fuck that guy. build houses and have a uh, max capitalization. Not bad. Yeah, I guess so. What do I know, though? I love it. Three millions tall because it's got a big name on it. And the materials are nothing special, but the everything else absolutely is. I'm a big guy, but I'm a big cantilever guy. Cantilever is when it hangs and dang, when it when it hangs off, basically. Uh, That's what cantilever means. It's just like a little, so like it, you build a block like this, you build like a shoebox, and then you like you let cantilever so it, and then you can build up on top it of it. Supports hangs. itself, kind of. Yeah. Not enough of hang. Well, it's like I think it's like three back for one out. Like so, if you if you want to go mm. ten feet out, you got to go thirty feet in. Gotcha. I think there's a rule. Yeah, physics. F yeah, it's all physics, Chris. Really, really tough stuff. But um, yeah, cantilevering is just so cool because it's just like you're you're in the tree line. I love like being in that that house. Did have some. It wasn't cantilever, but the way they positioned it was at the tree height. This is f fantastic. I wish I and I like that the, the fireplace looks used. I'm glad that. Oh, wow, look at that. Look at that view. Sick. Absolutely sick. I love it. I'd say the, the views were at 3 million bucks. I like it. I mean, I'm not usually like, a, the, the number's crazy, but what did, uh, what did this rich buy it for? Because that is a rich house. Yeah. Yeah, you better not. Where's the charts? I wanna see, why am I on Redfin? That's, that's problem number one. Let's see what Zillow says. Wow, 1,100 square feet, $1,130 a square foot, 18,000 views, 18 days on the market. Di oh, yeah, you f***ing jerk off. Oh, God, that's so aggravating. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah, the house has always been worth, okay, so now you put it up here. All right, so, yeah. I knew it seemed rich. It's too rich for me. I, I couldn't, I mean, I love the house if I had $20 million and I just wanted to own a case study, a 60s case study house. Um, it's definitely one of the ones, but this $3 million price tag is pissing me off like i i love it i mean i i would do it too but it's it's aggravating um it's absolutely infuriating uh, uh no on this is planning to leave the overpriced seattle area and move closer to my family in northeast pennsylvania good for you buddy i would i hope you're coming to this house yeah this is dope i love this thing I love the scale of this room right here. It's a nice big room, fireplace. Nice piece. All built in. I don't like the style of the built in. Um, this this little detail on the doors is not. It's okay. It's, it's a Frank Lloyd Wright inspired uh, house. That's what they're going to call it. I guarantee it. But a uh, great, great piece of property right here. I like this. This is the shit I'd be looking for if I was moving. If I was doing exactly what you were doing, I'd be looking for this stuff. Wow. First time to market. Try to keep those. These are nice. Kent Coffee, maybe. Where are my vintage guys at? What are those? These are. This is like three grand worth of bedroom sets. Try to keep those. It's good stuff. Nice. I love the layout of the bathroom. I'll take it all day long. You don't have any more of these, do you? Oh yeah. Oh. They're in the. Can I have one? They're in the kitchen. Oh no! no, no, no. Oh, I'm gonna grab like a, sal a seltzer or something. Yeah. Everybody, whatever you want, Chris. 
thirsty guy. Yeah, I like it. Period. Correct. Wow. Really nice. Flat roof. Roof needs a little work. It's beautiful. It's awesome. Landscaping needs a little work, but not bad. Lots of grass. Be ready. Be ready for some maintenance. Um, it's a great piece of property, man. I love this. I absolutely love it. It's a shame they didn't prune their hedges together and they pruned them individually for so long. Let them f grow together. Jesus Christ, I hate when I see that. Look, I just this was supposed to be one, you know, one smooth worm, and instead it's lots of top down, lots of aerial shots, huh? Jesus Christ. That's a great piece of property. This is a nice thing. Don't worry about this. I don't like this. I don't like this. Power washing and cleaning, bleaching, pool chlorine. But overall, nice piece of property. 579 feel, feels a little rich. I'm going gonna, gonna to walk over to my desk now. Yeah. Wow, you're walking all the way down. <laughs> Boy, uh, my arm's uh. tired. <laughs> Bob Saget, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the the bluestone entryway, uh, the covered. Uh, what do they call this thing? Of Frank Lloyd Wright, like. Oh, nothing. Hmm. Yeah, twenty two acres. Wow, that's a nice piece. Yeah, I, I like this thing a lot. I'd like to see. Uh, it sounds a little heavy handed in the price. This five seventy nine just sounds. I mean, you're in central Pennsylvania, but this is the shit I'd be looking for. Um, if the house isn't too expensive and you kind of get to the bottom that a piece of shit house is like a true piece of shit house is still for something, then this is worth the 20% the premium because you can rebuild it and the layout's fantastic. You're walking up some stairs every day, but all in all, I like it. Now we're, uh, this is the Ann Arbor house. Yeah. This house is bad. Um, sold for 80K in 2014. Sold for 80K? Damn. In, in 2014. Horny. How much does it sell for now? Six thirty. Holy shit! Also, thank you, Nat, for the five gifted memberships. Thank you, bro. Thanks, Nat. Thank you, bro. This house sold for eighty grand. It could be a family sale, but yeah, these mid-century ranches, man, these things trade hard. Wow. Fractal art by Yakov Agam. A Kamse rug. Mm. Nice Wayfair mirror. Wow. Really great, really great house. Yeah, these mid-century, these mid-century ranches kill. A couple of Fillmore posters. Wow, you got Shepherd Fairy. Nice Turkish rug in the kitchen. The placement on it's driving me literally nuts. Look at the cabinets. Beautiful maple flat front cabinets. Contemporary, beautiful. What? Jesus Christ. That's the flag. You know your, your all your flags, Chris? Um, That's not Honduras, is it? This one? Oh, that one? Yeah, that's, 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 that's the Honduras. bisexual that's, flag. What's that? Bisexual? No, that's Honduras. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go Michigan. Uh, Honduras. <laughs> 630 Gs. Jesus Christ. Price cut 20, 20 grand. I got to see if this thing bought. 505 and 19. 80, wow, holy shit. Nuts. That could be a family sale, though. Yeah. That could have been, like, you know, gifted. I don't know, because if it was trading higher, most of the time that's... Yeah. Maybe. I doubt it, though. Oh, that's some nice stuff out in Ann Arbor. Huh? Look at this one. Shit. This house is an open house Sunday. I'll be there, but... <laughs> Yo, this house is fast as fuck. Yo, this house fudges fudges fat. Yo, this is and you got y'all need a chocolate chill. 